See what happens is golfers will come here okay. and they'll train, I call it the most terrible move in golf. They'll come here and they'll train this. They'll train this, trying to get the perfect impact. Okay. But what that creates is a handle dragger. Okay. It creates a handle dragger. So I say if we're gonna train anything, train getting that trail hand back on top. Gotcha. See that? Gotcha. Gotcha. Get that trail hand back on gotcha. top, all right? I'm all, I always want a full release unless I'm hitting a controlled block. Okay. Yep. You I don't, you can't hit it no better than that, buddy. <laughs> okay. That was it. Yeah. All right, do that, that again. Felt, that felt good. Yeah, now we just got to get the reps in. Okay. That was it. Did it feel odd? You know, it, 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 what, what I have to train, my, what, I, what, I'm, what, I'm, what I'm fighting myself against is what you're saying, that cutoff. Yeah, don't do the cutoff, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Unless you try and, well, the ball is actually gone, mm -hmm. but where you finish tells me a lot about where you came from. Okay. Okay? Okay. okay. All right. Oh, no. A little thin. Yeah. Give me another one. SPP, setup, posture, patience. This is where we can actually look like a professional player in our setup. Good recovery. Really good recovery. Remember, we want passive hands and stable wrist. All right, that way with the wrist, you know, we can get some flexion, we can get some extension, we get some owner and some radio, okay? okay. But the wrists are real tight, we can't do none of can't that, none right? Of that. Yep. You know, so we gotta have soft hands, okay. passive hands, and stable wrists, okay? Okay. All right. Gotcha. And right now we just getting that right hand back on top. Okay. The trail hand. Trail hand back on top. The ball hold to finish until it land. All right, give me five more. Okay.